Thank you. So now we're headed to our, one of our favorite coffee places called the Commissary. We like to go here, just hang out, socialize. It's fun for us, fun for the dogs, it's fun for everybody else. They attract a lot of attention. And why wouldn't they? They're gorgeous. Join us. Hello, I'm Michael Bryan. These are my kids. This is Manu. He's a Weimaraner mix. And this is Chuka. Say hello, Chuka. Chuka's a pit bull mix. <laughs> she is. Uh, they're both rescues. A, uh, a, a cause that I'm very, very passionate about. Uh, we've been together for about a year and a half now. And uh, we're here in West Hollywood, California today, uh, where I've resided for about the past nine months. Before that, I was in New York City for 27 years. Uh, my focus primarily these days is dog photography. Uh, see, I've always had this passion for dogs, and I think I'm just coming to understand what it is these days. Um, I, I, I feel that I have a really innate uh, sense of, of speaking to them on their level, which is uh, might sound a little weird, but it's, it's telepathically animal. So I spent many years on that side of the camera, traveling as a model and former actor, doing national TV spots, and I've been lucky enough to continue those, those travels as a photographer. Uh, most recently, going over to Hong Kong to explore the rescue situation over there. We've been up to Vancouver on movie sets. Uh, we've been with professional athletes. It's just raised the social consciousness of what it means to be a responsible parent and dog owner in this day and age. So one way we, we help to solidify that bond of communication and, and, and connection is through the various field trips we take. And, and I speak of field trips in the sense of going on hikes. Uh, we go to the dog park, we'll go to the beach. We try to include them as much in our daily activities as possible. In order, beautiful hills of Hollywood, heading up to Runyon Canyon, one of our favorite places. Uh, usually in the morning, we head up there, get a little bit of nature, get a little exercise on. So we will see you up at the top. We're about to head up this hill. We have to talk at the bottom because you can't talk up there because you're out of breath too much. So, how's that for some hiking? Woo, woo, woo! We're here at the dog park, actually Balboa Dog Park, in the valley of Los Angeles. Uh, we come to the dog park uh, probably on the off days that we don't go hiking up in the hills in, in Runyon Canyon, pretty much to work on our training because there's a whole lot of distractions in there with all the other dogs and it helps us to uh, just kind of stay tight as a unit, kind of a bonding experience. And after we're all done with that, it's a great place for them to kind of let loose and go play, have a great time, and be dogs. So, you guys ready to go? What'd you say? You ready to go? You give me some love? You ready to go? And stay. So what we're doing here is just kind of getting tight with our commands, part of our training, that helps uh, solidify the connection between myself and my dogs because there's so many track distractions inside the dog park that we want all of the attraction between myself and them. Okay, down. Stay. And pass it, pass it, pass it, pass it, pass it, pass it. Good baby. Good baby. Okay, heel. Heel. Ready? Let's go play. Let's go play. Woohoo. What's up little buddy? What's up little buddy? Who's a little black dog? Who's a little black dog? Samson! What kind of dog is Samson? She's a German Shepherd with um, Border Collie. So this is Lucy. Does she like balls? Absolutely. <laughs> and who's Lucy's mom? Katrina. Katrina. I'm Michael Bryan. Pleasure nice to meet you. you. Uh, you've had Lucy for how long? Four years. And she is a wine runner. I adopted him, so I'm not 100% sure. Oh, my guy's the softest thing. He's yeah. like a freaking cotton ball. I know, eight years old. Oh, really my God. He doesn't have a gray hair on him. He does on his chin. Does he, uh, does he eat raw food by any chance? Because um, his know, coat is absolutely no, gorgeous. No, but I just started him on Ellen's um, Halo food. Uh huh. Because he started getting like some lumps, and I kind of like freaked out. How do you like that food? Um, it works good for him. Yeah? Yeah. I haven't tried it myself yet. <laughs> <laughs> I always try my dog food first, you know. If I like it, they gotta like it, right? That is a gorgeous dog, man. Oh, no. oh I got a good one. Oh, that kisses. 